YouTube, it's your boy Kobe TV, and I'm back with another react. I said I'm back with another react, man. Hey, if it's anything you want to know about your boy Kobe TV, just check the description, gang. I got all links. I got the TikTok, the Twitch, Snapchat, Instagram. I got all my links in the description, man. Y'all hit those platforms, bro. Hit me up. I'll text y'all, man. Boy, if you don't get... I lied. But, but that's besides the point. As y'all can see by the title, I got Young Miami claps back at JT after claiming that she hates her. Hey, so for those of y'all who don't know, supposedly, you know, they used to be the city girls. Y'all know they used to call each other, the, um, they, they little name used to be the city girls. But they had an um, a album just drop, and supposedly it's only going to get like six to 8,000 sales, bro. So supposedly they flopping right now. So I ain't gonna lie. Hearing this type of news, yeah, I knew this was coming. Now they finna bump heads. They ain't really making no money off the city girls no more. They ain't making no money off each other like that. They finna bump heads like crazy. So I'm gonna get I'm gonna get into the video and see what uh what uh young Miami and JT got going on. Cause I don't know what's really going on, but before we get into that video, man, make sure y'all smash that like. I'm talking about smash that like, gang. And hit that subscribe, bro. We on the road to 10K. Make sure if you new to the channel, turn on post notice, gang. Turn them post notice on. We dropping straight bangers. Hey, but we finna get into today's video and see what Young Miami and JT got going on, bro. Because sound like it's getting juicy. Sound like they trying to make some more money because they falling off. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, you guys, so some messages were allegedly leaked of JT talking crap about Young Miami. So she said, yo, I'm thinking about leaving the group. I don't want to be a city girl. Okay, so JT says, yo, I'm thinking about leaving the group. I don't want to be a city girl no more, and I'm tired of Carisha. She pissed me off so bad, you don't even know. I want her dead. And she put that in all caps. Dang, that's crazy. She said, somebody said, what did she do? She said nothing. She just gets on my nerves. I hate her so much. So if she didn't do nothing, why do you want her dead? Why Why is it so much hate? I could have sworn y'all was just City Girls dropping an um, album like last week or a couple of weeks ago. I don't, I don't really know. I ain't been keeping up with them. I ain't going to lie to you. I just heard about this news. But if she ain't do nothing, why you want somebody dead or why you hate them? So we just gonna ignore that girl no more and i'm tired of carisha she pissed me off so bad you don't even know i won't sound like dead. a little clout chasing and they to asked, me. what did she do she said nothing she just get on my nerves i hate her so much so she ended up responding to all of this she said the internet ish lame she said this internet shit lame for real but it's a lot of money and black ignorance i see why y'all keep it going so y'all know where she going with that, right? It's basically like the blue face Krishan shit. It's a lot of money and black ignorance. Basically, just be ignorant. You're going to make a lot of money off the internet because they're going to blow it out of proportion. That's basically where she going with that. And she not lying. I told y'all that. It's really how y'all make that cheese, man. Do some shit like this and they gonna, the internet going to blow it more than what it really is, bro. And for real, but it's a lot of money in black ignorance. I see why y'all keep it going. Now, some fans felt like this entire thread was fake, like me. I don't feel like it was real, okay? It just didn't. I ain't gonna lie. I think it's fake, too. I just think y'all y'all album was a flop, and y'all trying to, like, get everybody to come see what y'all got going on. That's how I feel about the situation. I could be wrong, but, hey, I'm just here to state my opinion on this situation. Not no facts, it's just my opinion about it. I think it's fake. I think you just doing that to get your name on the map again. Cause as of right now, City Girls, JT, Young Miami, that shit is dead. That nobody, man, ain't nobody walking around here talking about y'all no more. So of course y'all gotta do what y'all gotta do. Y'all see what Blueface and Krishan are doing, so y'all finna do it. I don't blame you. Get your cheese make sense but others felt like this is a publicity stunt so now allegedly young miami responded to what she had to say about hating her so she said all of a sudden young miami replies back with all of a sudden everybody hate me but i'm bookmarking everything 
I love to make a bitch eat their words. I, I guess. Everybody hate me. That's what you gotta. That's what you gotta everything. say. I that that's that's how you respond to somebody that say I want her dead. Yeah, clout chasing. Love to make a bee eat they words. And this is what fans had to say about that. I knew that this was coming. Told my daughter that they were not going to last. When both girls linked up with Diddy and Uzi, their partnership and friendship changed. I do agree with JT, however. Carisha does entirely too much. Her attitude reveals a lot about her. Things that are annoying and just plain country as F. JT is the better rapper anyway. Sorry, but not sorry. They trying to sell an album. Don't fall for this play. There we go. That's the comment I've been waiting for somebody. To, that's the same thing I just said, gang. Is it not? Let me know if that's not what I just said. They trying to sell an album. Don't fall for this play. Bro, they predicted this album to only get six to 8,000 sales, bro. That's trash as fuck for the city girls, for some people who was top artists back in the day. That's terrible, bro. So all they doing is they know they falling off. Everybody falls off. And they definitely falling off. Ice Spice, Sexy Red, Glorilla, all them came and passed them up. So now they just trying to get their name back on the map. So they got to do what they got to do. It's the fact that JT's message was a PR stunt, but people really showing their true feelings behind it. Wow. But the more and more that's coming out, I'm really feeling like this is a PR stunt. Now, in my last video, it I felt like is. maybe somebody made up the messages. You know how fans do. You know how social media is. They'll do something for no reason. But I am feeling more and more that this is a PR stunt. And look, it could be the fans. The fans could be doing it to help them out. But you see, they didn't clear it up. They kept it going. Even if it was the fans, they could have cleared it up. They could have been like, that's fake, blah, blah, blah. Me and JT, me, JT and Young Miami, we good, we cool. That shit fake. Somebody, you know, they ain't do that. They keeping it going. Why? Why not? Why clear it up when we getting paid off of it? We finna make our album do two times the predictions. You feel me? because their album sales are not doing what it's supposed to do. Their new album that dropped on- Look, there you go. Moreover, the duo is anticipated to sell between 6K and 8K album, equivalent units in the LP's first week based on initial sales. Projection as of writing this article as such. 6K to 8K album, there y'all go. I wasn't lying to y'all. 20th it's called Raw is only projected to sell between 6,000 to 8,000 units for its first week. So I'm kind of going towards that way. It just doesn't add up. This whole situation is just not adding up to me. But I do want to know what you guys feel about all of this. So leave your comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you later. Bro, the situation, it don't add up, but it add up. Like, on the don't add up part, I just feel like it don't add up because where did this come from? Why did it happen after the fact your album dropped and it flopped? Why all of this just now happening? Why all of this just now coming out that y'all beefed up or whatever? Like, that's crazy to me. I'm not understanding. Now y'all not the city girls no more and all of that. Yeah, right. Get as much money as y'all can make off of this. That's what y'all trying to do. We got to run our sales up, girl. Let's go. Let's let's get the internet popping. Let's try to do like Blueface and Krishan. Let's try it out. Shit. They, it's working for them. It's We finna try it too. I'm about, I want her dead, but she didn't do nothing. Hmm? Hey, man, let me know how y'all feel about this situation, man. I ain't finna hold y'all up. I ain't finna talk y'all nagging off about this, this weird shit. But, hey, if you stayed the whole video with your boy, man, appreciate you, gang. Make sure y'all smash that like, gang. I mean, smash that like, gang, and hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel, bro. We on the road to 10K. I need everybody to be tapping in, man. We got to do this as a group. One person can't get me there. I need all of y'all to be hitting that like and that subscribe, gang. We on the road. Peace.